Hi all, this is Pradipa from Informatica support videos. In this video, we are going to see how to create a reference table using a flat file in Analyze tool. The agent of this video is overview of reference table, prerequisites and the steps to create the reference table using the flat file in Analyze tool, demo and references. Overview of reference table. Reference table is a database table which should contain at least two columns. One column should contain the standard or valid data and the remaining columns contains the alternative versions of the same data. The column that contains the valid values is called the valid column and the remaining columns are considered to be the non-valid column. In a mapping, when a transformation reads a reference table, it looks for a value in the non-valid column. When the transformation finds a non-valid value, it returns the corresponding value from the valid column. We can create the reference table using Analyst tool and as well as in Developer tool. But specifically in this video, we are going to see it in Analyst tool. To create the reference table using flat file in Analyst tool, you need to check two prerequisites. First one is you need to create the flat file with valid and non-valid column and stored it in your local machine and the second one is you need to check whether the analyst service and the CMS services are up and running in the admin console. Let's get into the demo. Just click the analyst tool link present under the analyst service in the admin console. The analyst tool workspace looks like this. Just click new reference table Choose import a flat file, click next, choose the flat file from your local machine, click upload to view the data present in the flat file, click next. Just choose the delimiters, text qualifiers, every options according to your data present in the flat file. In the step 4, you need to choose the valid column. I named the reference table as reference underscore flat file. You can name it as per your wish. Just choose the project. Click finish. Now the reference table got created successfully. You can see the data present in the flat file over here and you can see the properties under this properties tab in the reference table. Here I have listed some of the document link and KB link where you can find more details related to this topic. We would love to hear from you the feedback. Please reach us on support videos at informatica.com as well as you can make a tweet at infosupport. Thank you.